For NASA, sending a person to Mars is simple, but dealing with Congress is hard. How dumb that sentence is. That sentence is so dumb. It's like if it's simple, why do you need 50 years, 30 billion dollars? Masturbating is simple. I need my penis, my hand, and a series of arousing thoughts visualized in my head. <laughs> you know, like that's simple. Taking a crap is simple. I eat food, I crap it out, I wipe my butt. Walking is simple. I put my left foot in front of my right foot while maintaining balance. Engaging in intercourse is simple. I put my penis into the vagina and then I move my penis in and out of the vagina until I've reached maximum pleasure states for both parties. Oh man. Okay, that one's not as simple as it sounds. <laughs> but it's like, gosh dang. I swear it's like every reporter now should just go into the name Grumpy Cat. Where Grumpy Cat says for NASA, sending a person to Mars is simple. But dealing with Congress is hard. To be continued. I'm a riffing this one all day long. Stay cool. Hey, if you don't shut up, I shall fireball your face. This is a Thor News presentation. Hit the button, baby. baby. Thor News presents. You don't need to ask the government. It's not there. We are at Twitter on the World Wide Web, and I shall now read you a tweet from the universe today. For NASA, sending a person to Mars is simple. Dealing with Congress is hard. I replied, worst astronomy headline ever. And that's saying a mouthful, man. That's saying a mouthful. It's okay, though. I still love you, though. I'm hoping to get a response or a defense to an article that I have not read yet. Because if I, I have only judged the title itself. I have not read the article, so I won't say whether or not it's bullcrap. We will read it together as one. Although I did read the first sentence... And it was hilarious. Allow me to over-dramatize, if you don't mind. So if you click that link, it takes you to Vox. Friday, February 6th, 2015. Jupiter, Opposition Day. For NASA, sending a person to Mars is simple. Dealing with Congress is hard. By Joseph Stromberg. On February 4th, 2015. E.T. Extraterrestrial. All right, at least he admitted he's alien. We got a little bit of honesty up front. Now, okay, I got severe problems with the headline. That's why I'm doing the whole video. NASA, if we go by public knowledge, NASA has never before in its history sent a man or a woman to Mars, ever. In the entire history of NASA, they've never once accomplished sending a person to Mars. If you believe conspiracy theorists there's a Nebraska deep space Navy who yeah they go to Mars all the time that's simple and if that's true then I change this to best headline ever best astronomy headline ever because it would basically be saying we want to tell you the truth we want to share the tech with you but the groups that control Congress the ones who drink blood and oil they don't want to share they don't want a thousand years of peace they want to torture people and drink their pain, blood, and spirits. All right, that's Cuckoo Land. And I only like to tiptoe run through Cuckoo Land really fast, telling a lot of jokes. So let's go back to reality for a second. For NASA, sending a person to Mars is simple, which is either a lie or 100% untrue, depending on your intentions. Because NASA's never sent a person to Mars. So I could write the same headline like, paying down the national debt is simple. Dealing with human beings is hard. For Thor, saving the world is simple. Give up war. Jubilee. Thousand years of peace. Dealing with people is hard. Where were we? NASA's never sent a person to Mars. So it's a totally unfounded claim proposed as a fact, which is horrible journalism. And it's not even journalism, man. It's like straight up NASA propaganda, NASA PR. There's no objectivity here. Science is basically saying dealing with people is hard. But we need more of your people's money. Hi, I'm Thor. I'm the unofficial, unelected representative, ambassador between you, the people, and 
the large space agencies and corporations. And I'm here to help everybody. If all roads are repaired, possibilities are endless. So you get NASA, which is basically a corporation, a publicly funded private operations corporation. And you got Congress. Congress is like a pop star who does what they want. They spend money how they want. We got to pay for it. And we have to bear all of their mistakes. Let's say they invade a whole other country on false pretenses. We, the Americans, bear the blame and the shame and the karma that comes with it. So that's why I'm here. I'm here to help everything improve, man. And it doesn't help when all I got is NASA lobbyists, congressional lobbyists, and corporate lobbyists, man. You don't want to kill the golden goose, and you fuckers are scaring the shit out of me. Hit the button, baby. I need your love.